Hello everyone, I'm your professor for English 102 and uh, this video is just a quick welcome video to get you started. So as you, uh, so it's Monday night right now and the course will open about eight o'clock tonight and of course everything begins tomorrow. So, um, so welcome. So just a few things I wanted to say to kind of get us started. First of all is um, you're going to make mistakes. That's normal. So you can't avoid mistakes. Your goal is to get better, right? So I always think of it this way, of course, you are wherever you are when you start, but by the end of the course, you should be better than where you were. I wanna see you change over time, get improve over time. So that's my hope for all of you, all right? So um, so there are, so that's why it leads me to say these next four things. So there are certain ways that students go wrong in the class or they fail. And the first reason they fail and the biggest reason they fail is that they skip assignments. So if you skip an assignment, you're really screwing yourself. And here's why. Um, if you skip an assignment, let's say assignment's worth 100 points. So if you skip it, you lose zero points. You get zero out of 100, right? And that's a huge hit. But let's say you do the assignment, but you fail. You did a terrible job and you get an F. You could still get like 50 points out of 100 for an F. So if an F is still 50 points, where skipping it is no points. So that really hurts you. So I really can't recommend you enough. Don't skip any assignments. Don't skip one. I've seen students who are on their way to an A get a C because they skipped to some assignments. Don't do it. Secondly, they don't follow directions. Really have to follow directions. If, it's, if the paper said, if my assignment says, use something from a certain page from a book, which I'll do, like they say, I say, do that. Don't skip that. That's a very important part of the assignment. Like I don't give good credit on assignments for people like, basically I don't give credit for people who don't do assignments when, I follow, when they don't follow directions. I'm like, well, that's not what I asked for. So it's very important you follow directions. So I would recommend, you read the directions, you do the assignment, then you go back and you're like, did I do all the things the directions said? Because there's always shortcuts and easier ways to do things, but I mostly wrote the directions to avoid the easy way. Because really the way you get better at something is to do the hard thing, all right? And the next thing I want to suggest to do is uh, to pay attention to feedback. A lot of students don't really look at the feedback. You know, they just, and I think it's because really they don't want to deal with it, right? It's a lot more work to look at the feedback, but I'll give you feedback to make your work better. You'll have a chance to revise some of your work and especially the work that's worth a lot of your grade. Like for the first two papers, you can always re revise those papers for a better grade, but you have to take advantage of the feedback. So we look at the feedback. So there are the four things, right? You're gonna make mistakes, be forgiving. Just your goal is to get better. Secondly, don't skip assignments. Third, follow the directions. And finally, read the feedback and use the feedback. Right. If you do those four things, you'll be good in the class. So go into the class starting tonight or tomorrow morning and just start reading and getting no material in there. OK. All right. Looking forward to working with all of you. Thanks very much.